the award show. It was, you know, I, I missed it. I don't know if you guys seen it. I, I missed it, but I made sure that I knew who, I, you know, who got the awards, who won it. Uh, the question is, who do you guys felt deserved the award that they got? Or who do you felt got snubbed or should have been uh, winning the award that they, you know, whatever award category they were playing for? <laughs> My man, Westbrook. Russell Westbrook uh, winning the MVP. Uh, you know, there's a lot of different opinions whether who should win it. Um, Harden, of course, is in that conversation. Uh, Kawhi Leonard. But I think Westbrook, you know, uh, making history, averaging a triple-double all year, never been done since Oscar Robertson. Oscar Robertson. Yeah. And a lot of people, crazy. including uh, LeBron James, said that no one's going to be able to do that again. Who do you feel uh, did not deserve the award or could have <laughs> did um, not deserved the award? Well, there's a lot of awards, yeah. Right? Yeah. I was surprised when, <laughs> throw uh, shade at. Yeah. when Brogdon got the Rookie of the Year award. Yeah, it's a, I was surprised too, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> I, I thought it was going to be uh, Joel Embiid. Mm-hmm. Or his teammate, um, sorry, true. sorry, yeah. yeah, yeah. Do you feel like it was the number of games that he played, or just the fact that he was rested? Like you know, if anyone's rested and then played, like he could have, like they could have played as much as well as Embiid, or it's just yeah. I think that has a lot to do with it. Also, the fact that Philly didn't really win a lot of games, mm-hmm. and Brogdon was a big part of Milwaukee, obviously. And mm-hmm. He played well too. He played well on the first play. He seemed so mature when he yeah. played. Yeah. yeah, I was actually watching that. I think we were watching that game, yeah. and I didn't really know who Malcolm Brogdon was. And I looked right. at him like, I've never seen this guy before, but he's yeah. making some moves. Yeah. There's some sometimes when you watch like, you're like, this guy can play. Yeah, so, the maturity that they have in their game is just yeah. He had you know he was mature enough to handle the situation that's something that you don't see in rookies too so I'm okay with him winning the rookie that's what I'm saying you're throwing <laughs> yeah. shit I don't think he's okay I mean okay. I was surprised Malcolm's okay with me I'm okay with it too but I was just, it's just so surprised Embiid played really yeah. well yeah, if you yeah. look at the numbers he's a beast right. though Yeah, he's a beast. when he comes back I think he was good who do you, how about you Raymond who you felt like deserved the award that they had and, or who didn't actually just uh, the rookie just cause I, like, like you I didn't really hear about him yeah. until the awards Yeah. so I was just a little thrown off cause I'm yeah. like who? who? Who's Brock? <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's not like uh, spotlight. Yeah. But in terms of Westbrook, like I totally agree. I mean, losing KD mm-hmm. is a big thing, it's but I felt like he stepped up. Yeah. And like took charge because yeah. he could. They could have easily, you know, done bad this year and had the reason of like, well, we lost one of our players, so forth. But yeah. Um, like like what KD said in his comment, you know, he deserved it and. That's yeah, the, that, I, I'm on, behind that 100%. Yeah. 40, what is that? 42 triple doubles? 42. Because 41 was Oscar Robinson. Yeah. And like when you watch, like you would actually go watch Westbrook. Like I'd watch Westbrook pray, even, pray, not pray, <laughs> play. <laughs> I'd watch Westbrook play. You know? just watch. Whether or not, whether or not it's, a, it's a playoff game or exhibition, I'd go watch. I'd pay a ticket to watch Westbrook play because he's so athletic. He plays with so much heart and passion. Like, Losing Kevin, losing like I don't even know. I don't even know if they were best friends or not. But losing a very great key player in your team, he could have easily, like you said, just gave up. But no, he came stronger. He took it personally, I think, and he went out and made this his basically best year. He got got the award. So it reminded me that. of like how um, Iverson used to play, where you know he was just aggressive. He just went at you like full on. Like he wasn't scared of anybody. It just reminds me of the way he plays. Like you know. Um, the excitement, the athleticism, the speed, he just re- carrying a team. That's what Iverson did a lot yeah. of the times when he was in Philly. It yeah. just reminds you of that. And it's good to have that kind of feel, right? Because that's what Westbrook did, as great as Kawhi or Harden did. Mm-hmm. I, I think there's something about Westbrook that just, you know, this year was just something you probably won't see for a very long yeah. time, right? You never know. Maybe next year. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 43 triple <laughs> 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 